Well, today in Frankfurt, a heavy police presence surrounded state capitol grounds as a precaution after the FBI issued a warning that armed protesters could appear in the days leading up to the inauguration. Armed demonstrators did show up for a period of time today. LX18 Sophia Millar breaks down what happened throughout the day. Leading up to the weekend, Governor Andy Bashir announced heightened security measures around the state capitol grounds, a precaution after domestic terrorists stormed the U.S. Capitol on January 6th. Police presence was heavy, with Kentucky State Police, National Guard, and Frankfurt Police present throughout the day. We want to be prepared for anything, and I feel like we are, and uh, if nothing happens, that's a great day. No mass protests took place, but an armed group of about 15 people did show up around 2 p.m. We're here to keep people safe. We're exercising our Second Amendment right so that people can exercise their First Amendment right. We didn't know what to expect today. We expected potentially a recurrence of what happened in D.C. Thankfully, that's not happening and it doesn't look like it's going to happen. But we're peacekeepers before anything else. The group identified as being based out of Louisville, but did not say who they were affiliated with. At times, they chanted anti-police rhetoric and confronted officers verbally. Other times, their chants echoed the ones we heard this summer during Breonna Taylor protests. No justice! No peace! The group dispersed within the hour. Other protesters did trickle in throughout the day, but they were mostly individuals turned away by officials on site. In Frankfurt, Sophia Millar, LEX 18 News. We have contacted officials guarding the Capitol tonight about how long they plan to be out there. We've not heard back.